Susan B. Anthony. Fighter for freedom and equality. I'll be everything that I want to be. I am confidence in its security. I am a voice yet waiting to be heard. Susan B. Anthony was born on February 15, 1820 in Adams, Massachusetts. She was raised by independent working women. She realized the unjust restrictions placed on women when in the middle school and her male teacher refused to let her learn long division because she was a woman. The fearless twosome Susan B. Anthony and Elizabeth Cady Stanton met in May of 1851 in Thinka Falls in New York City. A year later, in 1852, they started working on the temperance movement to make alcohol illegal in New York. They also worked for the anti-slavery movement and, of course, the women's rights. Women were so oppressed by men that they weren't allowed to decide to keep their child or not, join or have a say in political matters, or decide whether their country should go into war or not. Women during this time period strongly fought for the right to be able to vote and say what they feel. Many people often thought that women should be confined to one space and not be able to branch out and live their life. During the fight for women's rights, people would joke about Susan actually running male supremacy out of the United States for good. The most effective tactic that Miss Anthony used was protesting. Many supporters banded together and proved they weren't going to back down. Susan was arrested for illegal voting. On the day of her trial, she was sentenced to pay $100, but she refused to pay. She said to the judge after the verdict for this, May it please your honor, but I will never pay a dollar of your unjust penalty. Susan B. Anthony made many inspiring speeches during her lifetime, but the last speech she gave inspired the most people. She gave this speech on her birthday, February 15, 1906. This speech stated her most famous quote, failure is impossible. This quote led women everywhere to believe that they can make a difference and be equal and realize that giving up is not an option. It took 72 long and sorrowful years for women to be seen as equals in the eyes of men. Unfortunately, Susan B. Anthony never got to see her dream fulfilled because she passed away prior to the 19th Amendment being passed. To many women, Susan B. Anthony was known as Aunt Susan. But to women all across the USA, she is and forever will be known as the savior of women everywhere.